ladies 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 let's always be careful with whoever we trust whoever we give our heart hata kama amekuja amesema the lady alimwachia watoto wote sasa yako tu na watoto hata even they broke up mbona huyu lady after 2021 mbona ameamua 2024 is the time that she's coming up saying that matrix alikuwa abusive ladies 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 let's always be careful with whoever we trust whoever we give our heart let's always be careful watu wapo nje si wazuri si wazuri for you to trust someone means that that someone umeza kukana here for so long the time that you are meeting with someone avoid 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 hidden places avoid kabisa patana na mtu hadi kwa barabara patana na mtu hadi kwa highway hata ikiwezekana patana with someone kwa jam because people outside here si wazuri let's always be careful 100% careful with whoever we trust whoever we give our heart hello guys welcome to my youtube channel thank you so much for the support thank you so much for the love nyinyi watu true nyinyi watu true sana kama si nyinyi atungeza kuwa penye tumefika it's a new mileage we started this journey with you guys on january sai kuona penye tumefika people from south africa tanzania uganda canada shukran sana shukran sana lilian from south africa thank you so much mmekuwa supportive sana mmekuwa blessing to this our channel chris nolan tv we started as a joke but sai kuona the love and commitment yenye mmetupatia shukran sana shukran sana ondo na today's story want to talk about want to talk about Matrax the legend himself those people that know Matrax alikuwa ameimba wimbo kama kitambo tu kitambo alikuwa ameimba ma songs zingine very amazing eh kitu kama kauko poa kauko poa kauko poa the legend himself ameimba wimbo kali kali mmemwona pale alikuwa ameimba baka na kina nameless alikuwa kwa the council remember the time of council there was major Matrax and Kid Cora people wenye wanakumbuka hiyo kitambo Matrax alikuwa msanii hatari sana there was allegedly The wife amekuja ame come out that say that Matrix alikuwa abusive used to beat her each and every time amekuwa kimpiga amekuwa kimfanyia maneno mabaya that nini this remember that is a case that happened in the year 2021 signed of the lady the wife the wife amekuja amesema that Matrix amekuwa kimuabuse Matrix amekuwa kimfanyia vitu mbaya that he want to take action against Matrix guys there is something that we don't get over here This is a story that happened in 2021. Matrix for you to be able to judge. Please make sure that umesikia story from both sides. Matrix may come with tangible evidence to prove that there is nothing like that. Hiyo kitu ilifanyika in the year 2021 and the lady used to cheat on him. Ndio kwa maana. But Matrix hapo kufanya fiti. If someone ame cheat on you Please just walk away. Aina haja, aina haja, aina haja kushikilia. You just have to walk away to find peace in your heart. Aina haja ufanye mambo kama hizo. Unaona? You are a big brand. Wewe ni jina kubwa hapa nje. Watu wana respect hapo nje. But sasa hiku kuja kuchukua action on your hand si kitu fiti. But the lady amemwachia mpaka watoto, ali walk out na akaenda. Mbona after all that long from 2021, 2022, 2023 2024 now is the time that the lady is coming out to say that Matrix alikuwa abusive alikuwa sijui aje mbona hakutokea hiyo siku ya 2021 kuja kusema that Matrix amekuwa kimfanyia hivi 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 na hivi Matrix amekuja ame defend that the lady used to cheat on him the lady alikuwa anafanya mambo mengine the lady she is the one mwenye alitoka akaacha watoto eh sasa amekuja anasema na claim anataka watoto wake back After all amekuwa akifanyia matrix. Guys guys guys, we should not be judgmental. Tafadhali. He, hapo mambo ni hatari. We don't know what is really going to happen. What is really going to happen? But this a TBT ni kitu ya kitambo 2021, 2022, 2023, 2024. Sasa ndio ametokea amekuja anasema hivyo. That's the reason I'm telling you ladies, let's always be careful with whoever we give our heart. Ukiona red flag kwa mtu yeyote tu mwenye unakana eh 
kuna some red flag that this guy ako kuwa venye yuko even you can say unaweza kuja unaweza realize red flag kwa text the way this guy is texting you the way this guy anakuongelesha that's how you can know that this guy is a genuine guy or this guy is an abusive guy the way this guy even kwa text arrogant the way this guy is commanding ana command yani vitu tu na someone that mjapatana eh hata kwa text this guy ameanza tu kwa commanding that's the way you can find that this guy is arrogant and toxic let's jump in the story of Rita you know very well that Rita ni msichana mwenye alikuja akafanyia kamado hapo nini hapo Ruisambo the Rita waeni it's a very sad story but the victim is still on the run but my friend Whenever that you run, remember that the police will catch up on you. What you did, please, please, au kufanya kitu mzuri. You didn't do a good thing, please. Au kufanya kitu mzuri hata kidogo. Au takimbia, you can run but you will never ever hide. Au utaweza kujificha. The law will catch up with you. Hakuna penye utaenda. Just remember that. What you did to Rita is not a good thing. It's not a good thing. Ladies, That's the reason I'm telling you guys you're supposed to be very careful. But the police wana still wanatafuta huo jamaa. Atapatikana tu asidhani yeye ni mzito sana, atakimbia sana. You will be catch up and the family will be able to find justice na familia itakuwa at peace. After what the suspect did to Rita, au utatoroka sana. You are going to be catch. Uta uta utaenda sana. Just remember that. And the story of Matrax we should not be judgmental until we hear the story from both side at Vai kujaje don't judge don't judge we don't know what really happened Matrax amekuja amesema the lady alimwachia watoto wote sasa yako tu na watoto hata even they broke up the relationship what we call it a uh, marriage what we call a uh, nini what you are asking yourself as Kenyans mbona huyu lady after 2021 mbona ameamua 2024 is the time that He's coming up saying that Matrax alikuwa abusive mbona that 2021 akukuja ku come out is there something in yamona kwa Matrax inaendelea vizuri that he want to bring it down or what unaona that's a question that i can leave to you viewers to say what really happened you cannot be judgmental you don't know what really happened let's meet in our next episode i've been your host Jeff Otieno until next time game over